Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to my channel, San Joaquin Jr. On this channel, we discuss your constitutional rights and also go over videos of cop watches and First Amendment audits. Today's video was sent to me from my friend Popo Radar, and it comes from the channel Tim Newman. Make sure you head on over to both their channels and subscribe. On June 26, 2022, Tim was asked to leave what looked like private property. As he's doing so, he is driving towards the exit and is stopped by Officer Martinez of the Benton Police Department located in Benton, Texas. The officer tries to say that they need to verify that Tim has a license in order for him to drive off. Knowing he did not commit any traffic infractions, Tim refuses, and that's where we pick up on this video. So you're about to drive off and I want to make sure you have a valid driver's license. Because you're not supposed to be on the property. Well, and so I'm... I'll, yes, sir, so you're about to drive off, yes, sir. So, I need so to I'll, your I'll accept being to trespassed, sure. but I don't want to be ID'd. Okay, well, you're, to, you're driving off, right? We have to make sure you have a valid driver's license. When you does that, make, does that make sense? No, when you have a, when you when you have an infraction to pull me over for, then well, we're here. We want to make sure you're able to drive off. And you have a valid driver's license to drive off, right? I understand so that you want to do that. Motor vehicle without a, a bad license, right? And do you suspect so that I don't have a license? Well, we got we got to make sure. No, you don't. Yes, sir. We do. If you're driving off, yes, sir. No, yeah, you you can't just pull people over for. I'm not pulling you over. I'm making sure you have a driver's license for you to be able to drive off. And what makes you suspect I don't have one? We gotta make sure, we gotta double check. Do you have insurance on the vehicle? Surely do. Okay, do you have that with you? Surely do. All right, can I see that? No. You have to have insurance to drive off, yes sir? And you have to have a driver's license to drive a vehicle, right? Does that make sense? Surely does. Okay, well, we have to make sure that's, that's what's and going on. And when you have a, a, a reason to suspect we that do. I well, don't. We have a reason that you gotta drive off. Because you're not supposed to be on the property. And I'm yes, and happy to leave the property. We have to make property. sure you have insurance and a driver's license does that make sense no it doesn't it makes sense if you pull me over for an infraction so officer martinez says that tim needs to provide his driver's license because he's leaving the property and needs to verify that he can drive this has to be one of the worst attempts at getting someone to hand over their license for no reason luckily tim is no slouch and is very well versed in his rights he knows that in order for martinez to demand his license he would have had to commit a traffic infraction and since he didn't he refuses to surrender his license. Tim is in the right here. There's no law that states you must surrender your license to police to verify if you can drive or not. Furthermore, if this man came onto the property of his own volition, then he can leave the same way as well. Police often think that what they say is law, but rarely are they ever in the right in most cases. In these cases, people hand over their information without the knowledge of what their rights are, and they end up paying the consequences. That's not how this works, sir. You're not supposed to be on the property. You're gonna have to drive off in your vehicle right right and, for and us that's to let and that's you, the and trespass to, I'm, us, I'm accepting being hold trespassed on, hold on for us to let you do that we have to make sure you have a current driver's license and insurance for the vehicle what makes you suspect i don't have it well we have to make sure am i under arrest no you're not sir then unless you've got me on an infraction of some of some kind i don't have to identify okay, are you where are you heading after this so uh, where are you going off the property, I guess. Okay, but well, where? What's your next move? We'll head off the property. Okay. Are you gonna Are you gonna go in onto any private, any, any public driveway, like any any public road? Is that where you're going? Eventually, you, sure. Okay, then we gotta make sure you got a driver's license. And when you see me put, uh, with an infraction on that public roadway, then you can pull me over. Okay. Well, we're not gonna let you drive off if you don't have a driver's license, sir. Is your supervisor about? He's watching. And what's he, what's he got to say? Hey, Sergeant. Hey, Dave's got to get off property. I don't think we have an office. Okay. All right. Cool with me? All right, you're good. Thanks. You have guys, a good one. you have a good, good day. Yes, sir. And just like that, Officer Martinez was educated and told to back off. He was probably informed that what Tim was saying is true, and that they could not demand his license from him. Now, Tim did state that he is aware of the trespass warning and is accepting of that. I'm guessing the owner no longer wanted Tim there and called the police to ensure that he leaves. Regardless of that, Tim knows his rights and knew that he did not need to identify. I gotta give credit here to Tim for standing firm and not letting Martinez lie his way into getting his license. Martinez's logic was that Tim was going to use a public roadway and that his license needed to be verified. But that's just not the case. I want to give a huge shout out to Tim Newman for this awesome video. Be sure you all head on over to his channel, subscribe, 
and let him know Sam Joaquin Jr. sent you. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for watching. First Amendment rights, I'ma speak my mind. I don't care about how you feel, cause I'm living mine. Pay them tax dollars, I put in some overtime. I keep my camera rolling, I don't believe it was a crime. We caught watch, watch us hold them accountable, they ain't about nothing. Cause we be standing our ground and we is not running. And this is all real life, so learn a lot from it. God watch. God watch. God watch. God watch. God watch.